of storage. So yeah, I, I'm guessing Bizerk just so happens to be the only one left after all that. But anyway, speaking of Bizerk, he is uh, Bizerk's here. So seems to me that Blue would have the first ban. So Team Ireland has going to ban the first map. So it seems to be that they have banned 11 and Singapore has banned 18. I mean, for 11 ban, not surprising. Uh, hold on, where the hell is my stuff? And Singapore has uh, picked 25 and Ireland has picked 10. All right. And now we move on to the second one of bans. Let's see what uh, Ireland will ban again. Let's update this thing real quick. Okay, so Ireland have banned 22 and 21. So we'll wait to see what Berserk's RNG2 would say for the other three maps. Uh, yeah, it's okay. I'm not sure he's recovered. I mean, he has been... I've been talking to him on voice chats recently, but I'm not sure he has recovered from COVID at all. So I'm not sure. I have not looked at uh, Latvia's uh, point of view, I think. So I'm not entirely certain if he's even playing yesterday at all. Alright, anyway, uh, 13, 6 and 15 are the map, final 3 maps for this match. If we do get to map 5 or map 4 even at this point. Just give me a moment, I'm just typing. Oh my god. Go, can I type? There we go. There we go. Okay. Hopefully the text is big enough for the viewers back at home. But yeah, good luck and have fun. And we are about to start... Match number, sorry, round number 4, TSC Winter 2022, uh, Singapore versus Ireland. Uh, wow, surprisingly, we are starting with a black map already, so... I would say it might be yet again another Count Fiesta because uh, Team Singapore has already played this map once. I'm not sure uh, if Ireland has. So, I mean, I could just have a quick look in match results. Hello, Kelva, welcome to the match. Obviously, we still have to wait for two minutes of warm up, as always, because you know, just in case internet issues or and whatnot. Uh, totally not looking. Okay, Iron has played twenty five before against Latvia. Uh, they did lose there, right? And they also play against Romania, okay. But they did one against Romania for... I mean, Ireland won against Romania on that map as well with 5-2. That's about it. Yeah, okay. So, it's not... Definitely, this might be a close match because Ireland has played this map twice. While Singapore has only played this map against Brazil. Yeah. In the main match 3 where they won, like, completely dominated Brazil. Or should I say Bonzil? I don't know. Because... I mean, I mean, I, no, it's not on me. I mean, Matt literally put his team's name as Bonzil, so yeah. <laughs> but anyway, uh, less than a minute to go. Uh, yep, they are still warming up. So yeah, I don't know who's really the favorite here because, you know, sometimes they say experience trumps uh, skill, because especially right now, because Ireland has played this map twice yesterday compared to Singapore's once. So yeah, I'm not sure who to say who will win this, like, like who will dominate who much and uh yeah we'll see we'll see also i'm just gonna say this i'll be using a replay cam i'm not really gonna use follow all because follow all is trash for most of the time especially in map 11 because map 11 is like in a box you know it's in a box so you can't really see from afar what's happening so yeah also yeah it's like i cannot it's like if i want to switch to let's say to an irish player i have to use this so it's not really that professional so i apologies in advance but yeah here we go we're starting off with the first one i guess we'll just stick with an irish since we have irish views this stream also with the best start actually of the six players that we have right now oh well she's taken a i think he might lost some speed there spider now with a great line through that left left hander now 1v2, Starlight trying to catch up in 4th place, Bubsify and Hotswat are currently leading for... Oh sorry, should I say 1-3 at the moment. Spider now is 2nd. Starlight have, has overtaken Hotswat, so that is still looking up as soon as I say that Starlight has crashed, so that's not looking too good for Team Singapore at the moment. 
Spider's still hanging there in second, but Bloodseeker is well and truly in front. Oh, hold on. I know has overtaken the place. So that's... That's uh, quite surprising. I'm not sure how he's gotten that much, but Hotsword gets third place back. Spider... Spider's now overtaken the lead as we go to the water section. A get very clean. I'm not sure if the rest have. Looking behind, like, where is everyone at the moment? I... <laughs> I... It, I think everyone has uh, failed that pretty miserably. So that's a one two for Team Singapore. Uh, where is everyone? Oh my goodness, that's a mess. It's a mess for Team Ireland. I think. I think it's like I think it all collapsed in that water section. So yeah, that's one near the Team Singapore at the moment. Yeah, I at least I didn't curse Team Ireland at the very least right now. So but I'm. You know what? I'm gonna stick to. <laughs> I'm gonna stick to Ireland. Uh, one island space at the moment. Uh, wow, Spider for a great start. Hot Sword in second. Nice names get hidden underwater. I never knew I said that. Oh, I know has lost control and has crashed out. So it's up to Spider to carry the team yet again as Team Ireland currently holds a strong position going up to the plastic section. If I say the first one, that is, there's quite a lot of plastic sections on this map. Bob C5 and Hot Sword closing in on Spider. Seems Spider might have lost some speed. Somewhere. I don't know. We go through the plastic loop. Plus if I have a great entry into the half wall, oh, I, I forgot what's the correct terminology for that. And it's now neck and neck between Bubsify and Spider. Spider still slightly ahead. Slightly ahead. Hot Sword is in third. So it's looking good for Team Isla, but Starlight might change that outcome at the end. But here it comes the very important thing. Bubsify looks to be well ahead. Where the hell is Spider? Oh, wait. Am I confused? The spider? Oh, spider was here. Okay, wow, nice. Again, water gets hidden. Uh, but I, it seems to me that Ireland has gotten the 11 points they need because they finished second, third, and fifth. Uh, yeah, because I know just crashed earlier. So, yeah, it happens. So that's Ireland now taking a 2-1 lead, surprisingly. As I said, this might be a map that uh, experience might pay off because, as I said, Ireland has played this map twice. Yesterday compared to Singapore's once. Alright, uh, I'm gonna switch to a Singapore player for now though. Because uh, Spider, oh fucking hell. Well, I didn't curse Spider, but I did curse Starlight. Because Starlight legitimately flipped on the uh, that reactor boost there for some bizarre reason. But if I now well truly ahead, Spider and I know trying to salvage Team Singapore's position at the moment as they are 2 and 4. What? How do you pronounce Washi's name? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna call, call it Washi. <laughs> Sorry, um, uh, uh, yeah, wash it correct, yeah, because I is Ireland, okay. Spider now might be overtaking uh, Bob C4, but it seems that water bounce wasn't so great. And the uh, following wall white isn't that great either. E is wash it, okay, okay, yeah, sorry. I, I, yeah, I mean, I know IE stands for Ireland. Sorry. This is what happens when at the bottom it capitalizes everything, so I wasn't really sure on the name itself. But yeah, Spider still maintains the lead as we go to the water section. But it seems to me that Ireland might win this one again, unless Ireland makes mistakes here. Yeah, I know it's not going to be able to catch up. And that's a nut. But did someone crash in the finish? Yeah, I believe Butterfly crashed in the finish. And therefore, that gave Singapore the win. Yes. <laughs> um. Yeah, I mean, the replay camera didn't do a good job of like holding it long enough to see it but yeah that was unfortunate for team Ireland. so that's uh see i've lost count we actually wait we, oh are we two one up okay um i was surprised i thought we would Ireland was the one that's two one up but it turns out it's actually singapore that's two one up at the moment sorry apologies for the incorrect scorekeeping at the moment but yeah uh hot sword it's has a better start but if i in second place spider doesn't look i mean isn't that has a better Better start this time around, but you know, he's pretty quick usually. He is obviously the best single player or in track minor 2020. Far, far away, not gonna lie. So, uh, anyway, speak enough of that bias. Uh, yeah, Team Ireland is still 1 and 2 coming into the plastic loop. By the way, wow, great loop. Legitly taking 1v2 at the moment as he overtakes both Batsify and Hot Sword. Okay, Spider might low sun speed. Once I saw. 
So it's now back to Island 1 and 2. As we go back to the water section, will anyone mess it up again? No, nope, everything seems clean. So obviously, I cannot see who is neck and neck. Are they neck and neck? But see, Fighter and Hotswat are neck and neck. But Batswat will take it. And that's a win for Team Island. Yes, because, uh, yeah, 6 4 and 2 are good enough. Kind of close, actually. So that's 2 2, actually. Yeah, nice. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna switch. All right. Yeah, sorry. I mean, I wish I wanted to use follow all, but I can't. And I, for some reason, my key bindings are not working for changing canvas. I'm not sure how my friend Versus 14 does it, but I cannot change canvas with a key binding. So, if anyone knows, please let me know. But Spider is now far, far away to taking the lead at the moment. Possify in second place. Uh, Starlight. I think slid out a bit, so he's all the way to the back again. And I know as well, I think. So Island in the game, strong position. Uh spider. Okay, I should switch to spider because we're getting way too far at the moment. Let's go SG, yeah, whatever. Hello. Uh Spider well and truly a hit, but Island again still has a strong position. They just need to play safe and not screwed up at the water section. We move into that right now. Did anyone bounce? No, nope. all is up. Now, I, I, when I say that, it, it turns out my, Team Singapore was the one that did that mistake. So that's well and truly Ireland's win right there yet again. Yeah, well, Vasquez has been having that livery for a while now. He played that last season as well. But that livery isn't really helping the course right now as Ireland have lost... Uh, sorry, have won this one again. So that's now, they've taken the lead. Finally, they've actually taken the lead now. So that's 3-2. Yeah, that's... Uh, I mean, I wouldn't say it's expected, but also unexpected. Because uh, especially Starlight. Starlight's not really uh, warm up, you see. Because he's usually very close to Spider on this map as well. So I think consistency... Consistency is really bad at the moment. Hopefully we can recover. As soon as I see that Starlight freaking crashes on that dirt turn over there. So uh yep, sorry Starlight, I cursed you again. Yeah, that bounce is rough, yeah, because if you turn too early, yeah, you're gonna float up for no reason. Oh, speaking of floating up, but if I has clipped that a bit, so Spider is now well and truly a hit. Hot sword is in second place. But obviously Butterfly clipping doesn't change Island's position as they are yet again second, third and fourth. Or should I say 5th as uh, Dalai is trying to mount a comeback here to salvage Team Singapore's position. Wow, he's, wow, Starlight, really, he's going all the way to 3rd place. Spider is like well and truly ahead as we go to... Uh, sorry about this. Spoiling the situation. Uh, it seems Starlight might have slid out a bit there, so I think he lost time there. Yeah, he did lose time, so again, I curse this and they should win. Unless I know is the yeah no I know was last again so Ireland has won that round so uh, yeah that's four two okay can Ireland take first blood and win one nil go one nil at the moment oh shit I forgot to turn on music sorry but I did lower down the music so hopefully it doesn't affect the votes later I mean it is the MCA three. It's not a big problem, but anyway, back to the match. Spider again for a great start. He's been really consistent so far, but sadly, it's sad to say that Team Singapore, others, the other Team Singapore members are not as consistent. Oh, as soon as, yep. Okay, yeah, you see, that, like Starlight's literally proving my point. He's literally crashed at the checkpoint yet again. So maybe I should not be spectating him for much longer because he's clearly feeling under the pressure at the moment. So yeah, again, not looking too good for Team Singapore at the moment as yet again. <laughs> Coming to the loop island, uh, looks like they might be going 1-0 on map 25. Oh, so I may I have cursed because Ainos has taken over 4th place. So there is some hope. If one of Team Island's members have cursed, uh, sorry, have messed up the water bomb. Maybe, I don't know, it wasn't very clear because for some reason the replay cam doesn't show what's happening. I did kind of crash there. Oh, what did I say? Yep. Um, I know has taken second place. I uh, yeah. Again, I I guess Ireland messed up in the world section yet again, and Singapore has salvaged something. Disappoint. Yes. 
Where the hell is Stala even? Sings. <laughs> yeah, we have a Wong song there. Which one's the original? Okay, two people did not even finish that round. That was well and truly a clown fiesta right there. Yeah, this is the, the limitation of replay cam. It's like you can only see so far. And uh, like at least for this man, it doesn't show like a good overview of certain parts of the map, especially the last section, unfortunately. Speaking of uh, last sections, uh, Spider didn't have a good start as he has been so far on this map. So uh, Ireland have taken a strong position here. But Spider again with great speed above the plastic. Um, I lost for words right now. Starlight is in the amount of mix. So Singapore might be getting another point here. But I'm not sure unless I'm hopefully not going to curse Starlight yet again. Spider now well truly ahead at the moment. Starlight now in third place. Can he keep it? Because he's definitely challenging the Irish players at the moment. <laughs> Excuse me. Starlight still in fourth. As, as it stands, it's actually not. Wait, no, it is enough. It is enough. Okay, going through the water section. Yeah, it does. Oh, is that is that one signing out? Spider manages to cling on to first place despite the slight slide out. Starlight is third place. And uh, yeah, that is enough. I know got that last point. So we are going to four and four. Yeah, he hides, he hides the ghost. I'm not sure why. It's like, even if I switch to follow all, like... Okay, let's let's try follow all right now. Fuck it. We're gonna go follow all. You see, it, it hides the ghost. Like, why would you do that? Freaking Nando, man. No. But yeah, we, we're, going, we're going to be a follow all right now. Spider seems... See, I can't even see what's happening in the water. Spider now. Ghost. We hot sword. Yet again. Oh god, who's that? But if I might have a bit of an internet connection and he... Picking phases to certain parts of the track. Spider and Hot Sword. I see, uh, you see, this is probably follow-up cam. I can't see what's over there. Okay. Spider still in the lead, followed by Hot Sword and Aino. Walshi is in fourth. Might be overtaking Aino. Yeah, he did. Uh, Starlight is really not having a great time anymore. Not gonna lie. He's been, I would say, he's been definitely being hard carried at the moment on this map, which is a far cry from yesterday as we go downhill. Spider is well. Has a little bit of get to hot saw as we go through that tricky wall section. I know is currently in fourth place. As it stands, Ireland will still win unless I know gets third place. As we go through the water and I can't see shit because I, I love track media esports. Spider should be taking first place and I think I know has messed up the water section. And Team Ireland takes first blood. Yes. So that's 1 0 to Team Ireland. Yeah. Is it. <laughs> this map is horrible for spending, but uh, it, it, it was uh, it was salvageable. So yeah, Ireland has taken map 25 on the board. As we move on to the second map, which is uh, map 10. I don't think map 10 has ever been played. Yeah, as I said, Kelva, uh, Ireland has already played the map twice. They, they play in two matches compared to Singapore's one, so it kind of shows right there. I <laughs> love chat minion esports. Yep. I don't have the emote, unfortunately, because I actually don't have a single 7TV emote at the moment, so I apologize for that. But yeah. I don't really stream often, so this no. I, I, I can't justify adding emotes, unfortunately. So yeah, we're in... Are we map 10 already? Yeah, this is map 10, yeah. Have we played map 10 before? I think we have, I'm not sure. Yeah, quite a close one so far. Let's check previous results from yesterday. Uh, I don't... Okay, again, Ireland has played against USA on map 10. So again, experience, match experience could be key. Because Singapore, I don't think, has played this map at all. No, it does not look like it. I'm checking the Discord. We have not actually played this map at all. Hold on a moment. I'm just checking... No, we have not played a single map 10 yet again, so I don't know what's like, that's that's quite surprising. I mean, it, this is, uh, who picked this? I forgot. I actually forgot who picked this map because it's so far away. Uh, I think it was Ireland that picked map 10 actually. So yeah, I would say I, since this is Ireland's pick, yeah, this Ireland might have a huge hand in it. Yeah, it is definitely Ireland's pick. 
Which is probably the reason why, you know, they've been... Well, they didn't... I wouldn't say they won it, but yeah. So, yeah. I would definitely say Ireland are favorites for this. But And yeah, so Singapore definitely has not played this map at all. Whether it's been picked by your team or not. RNG has not picked map 10 for Team Singapore. So, we might be in a bit of trouble here. So, we'll see how it goes. It might be bloodshed. At this, as, as I, I, I say that even when I'm biased. It could be quite bad. Was, but we'll see. Um, see, as one up concludes, and we are on our way to map N. But we'll see if uh, Ireland dominates this map. But we'll see, because I mean, it, it is quite disheartening to have your map pick and still have to lose that first map as well. So hopefully, Team Singapore aren't that tilted. We move down here. Hotswat well and truly hit. I can clearly tell Hotswat has been training this map quite a bit. Surprisingly neck and neck for the rest of the pack at the moment. As we go down here yet again towards some plastic. Oh, and Spiders made a mistake. So, uh... Uh, yep. Hotswat well truly hit. And not surprisingly, Team Island takes a 1, 2, and 3. Hotswat with a sub 31. And, uh, yeah. That's 1-0 to Team Island. Yikes, not look this do it doesn't look that great for, <laughs> for Singapore at the moment. As we uh, go on to round number two. Nice camera and audio. Island again looks to be pretty good. Again, Hot Sword. Yeah, Hot Sword definitely has this map. Like hands down right now. So it's up to Team Singapore to do something about it. I know it seems to have crashed, so he's lagging behind. Spider and Starlight are challenging Walshi and Bubsify and as soon as I say that Starlight is no longer challenging Bubsify and Walshi because they crash and therefore yet again uh Team Ireland are the victors yet again in this one. Uh are they allowed to pick a one to five maps? Apparently map five is part of the map pack. But other than that, no, the other white maps are not in the map pack, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Hotswat definitely is a big factor in this map right now because it's doing sub 31s pretty consistently. Thank you for the information. Yes, apparently 5 was only only appeared because map 17 was removed. Uh, which is again not uncommon because in previous seasons. Oh, as soon as we speak about Hotswat, Hotswat has definitely crashed right there. Yeah, we might have cursed Hotswat a bit there, but I think Ireland might be still winning this. Hotswat just needs to finish. Hotswat just needs to finish. Can he finish in time? Can Hotswat finish in time? Can Hotswat finish in time? He still has time, I think. Yep, he can finish. Yep, and that's still a win for Team Ireland because 11 is more than 10. But yeah, as I was saying, white maps being played in TSCC are not uncommon, especially because like because of a certain map that might have issues like some of the previous seasons quick maps yes i do did say 11 is better than 10. anyway back to follow all i do not want to curse hot sword again instead i know has gotten the caster's curse because he's clearly last again oh my god this camera what the fuck hot sword well and truly hit but it seems starlight is actually the one in front for team singapore which is quite surprising bubsify um, I believe both Stella and Spider crash at the same section. So, uh, yet again, that's a win for Team Ireland. So, I think that's 3rd, 3, 4 nail now. Goodness, that's pretty quick. This map's... Couldn't be more dominating, to say the least, for Team Ireland. Because they are just one map round away from taking a 2 nail lead. Going into the third map. Can Team Singapore salvage anything? And I don't think they will. Because, as I said, this is... A reason why it's Ireland speak, because yeah, <laughs> Singapore probably did not practice this at all. Oh yeah, it is. I am very impressed to do even sub thirty ones consistently by Hot Sword. Yeah, that one's very really impressive. Oh, well, speaking of uh, consistency, Walshi has crashed. So uh, can Singapore get a point? It looks maybe promising because it's five, four, and two, right? Yep, Singapore have taken one back. Could this be a start of a comeback? I'm not really too hopeful, but hey, we've taken a point off Ireland on their map pick. <laughs> Lovely point of pin of Guinness, yeah. 
We do have Guinness here in Singapore, but unfortunately I don't drink alcohol, so I cannot say how good that drink is. But yeah, we do we do have Guinness here. We import a lot of stuff, like every single famous beer from all over the world, we have it all here. Carlsberg, uh, Tiger Beer, wait, no wait, Tiger Beer is... Tiger Beer I'm not sure you will consider it Singaporean, but yeah, we do have Tiger Beer there as well. Let's go, Custer. <laughs> okay. Uh, speaking of hot spot, uh, hot spots probably crashed. So Singapore, uh, they seem to have some momentum because they are one, two, and four. Uh, sorry, one, three, five. Now it's oh, crying out loud. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, but I just don't drink alcohol in general because I just don't drink it. It doesn't matter. It's not because of Guinness or anything. So don't worry about that. But uh, yeah, I think Singapore have thrown that away. So uh, yeah, they clearly won that one. Uh, is there even a curse at this point? Like, they were well and truly ahead until they won. It seems like the curse seems to be on that particular last turn, so... Yeah, that was not good for Team Singapore as they are losing 2-0. And Ireland just needs one more map win. And it's the first of the RNG maps, which is map number 13. Uh, map 13, what the fuck's map 13? Do I even play map 13 at all? I did, but I'm not sure if teams have. Uh, let me just check the previous results from yesterday to give a bit of context. I don't think so, no. map None of the map trees have map 13. So this is a pretty much an unknown, I think, for both teams. Yeah, I like this map as well. I mean, definitely not because it has dirt on it, because I like dirt maps in general. But it's probably because... Uh, Pretty straightforward to be honest, there isn't really any problematic parts of this map. So uh, yeah, if you want to be fast, you can go fast on this one. Finish is a bit boring, not gonna lie. It's just like, oh yeah, reactor boosts up and just... I mean down and up and just go into the finish. It'd be very hard to finish, fin uh, sorry, to miss the finish, but... Uh, hopefully I do not curse that and someone actually misses one of the finishes. I hope not. But... Uh, yeah, yeah, I heard it's easy to overjump if I'm not mistaken. If you have too much speed going through that uh, reactive boost ring, yeah, you could easily miss the finish ring actually as well. So yeah, uh, hopefully no one misses it because it'd be... Especially, uh, yeah, if you're like, oh my god, I'm fast as fuck, boy, and they just forgot that, you know, they need certain speed to make, make it to the ring safely. Which is again, not something Nadio is uh, really consistent with their map making skills, but there you go. It's like they didn't take into account that <laughs> reactive boost is too fast for the finish ring, but hey, it's up to us to find the flaws, you know, of every map. There's a reason why there's been less and less cuts in like this few campaigns, because they just really don't want people to find khaki like cuts, I guess. I don't know. It's, like I feel like this campaign doesn't have a lot of like actual cuts compared to previous ones, so yeah. I don't I've not seen a single cut, even from yesterday. Yeah. But yeah, anyway, we're starting map three. Uh we are still gonna use follow all cam because it's I think this might be suitable for this map. Pretty open area map. Yeah, they mostly minor cuts, especially map 11, the one that got banned because that's a, that's a cut in the last section of the box lay, I think. But yeah, uh, again, not surprising Hot Sword is currently up ahead, but he's neck and neck Spider. Spider has good speed on that particular section though. Uh, nice camber again. Spider and... Oh, for fuck's sake, Spider's fucking crash yet again. And Hot Swords and Washi have overtaken Spider. As we go through the final sector, would anyone miss the finish? Can the camera even keep up with the thing? Yes, they can. Yep. Uh, yeah, that's a win for Team Ireland. Yeah, it's YOLO. It's not very consistent, I heard. I don't think, like, we did play Mac 11 once yesterday, Team Singapore, and no one did the cut, so... Unless you're very desperate, uh, yeah, no. You wouldn't want to do that in a live round, let alone matchmaking round, so, yeah. No one's gonna do it in a live round. But yeah, good start from Team Ireland as they take a 1 0 lead on map uh, 13. Sorry, also, why am I showing my clock? Sorry. Barlight like has a better start, surprisingly. Uh, Spider also with him. So looking good for Team Singapore at the moment. Hopefully, I'm not jinxing it yet again as the camera goes very wide because 
I don't know what we now this camera work right here. Hot Sword now challenging Spider and Starlight and has overtaken. Wow, Hot Sword has a lot of speed on that final section and looking good for Hot Sword, but not looking good from Ireland as uh, Spider and Starlight takes five and four points. So I know just needs to finish. I think. Wait, what's what's going on here? What is going on? Where the hell is uh, the third island? Oh, okay, wow, okay. Wake Beast just disappeared because I could not see him, but uh, yeah, uh, that was a clown fiesta if I never see him. Yeah, I'm going back to replay cam by the way. So we're just gonna stay with Hot Swap for now. Let's see how he looks like with replay cam. But yeah, uh, that was a clown fiesta that PS1, uh, but Island still won that, so it's 2 0. Yeah, Brick almost threw that, I think, because I think, like, both him and Aino kept crashing for some bizarre reason. Speaking of Fort Sword, uh, he's currently in the lead with Washi and Starlight. Just close behind. Quite close, actually. Uh, Spider's really not enjoying this map. Our best player is not having a good time. And I would say Aino as well, to be honest. As we go through the finish line, what the fuck is this camp work by now, dude, at the moment? Well, uh, Starlight did get second place in the end, but again, Ireland, uh, Ireland has won that pretty convincingly yet again. So that's three 0 It's it's going downhill within Singapore after losing that second map really badly in the first map, narrowly. Uh, yeah, it seems seems Singapore might be a bit demoralized, and the exit door is definitely opening wider as the map goes on right here now big oh wait who crashed oh that was washi that crashed okay team singapore might have a no they actually don't because i know just fucking crashed fuck off anyway sorry for the swearing i mean swearing's fine but hot swear and spider are now neck and neck they go to that final right hander they go to the finish uh might be still enough if i know finishes fifth uh, who is actually gonna finish? I know! Has salvaged Singapore yet again. We finally got a point. It's not over yet for Team Singapore at the moment. I have so many click worthy moments already and it's only map G. Well, I just hope it wouldn't stop because Singapore definitely needs to win this one. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's like the players are doing the moments for me. I don't know. I am definitely not... Uh, paying this place any paper money to do those crashes, so don't mind me. But anyway, we're sticking the hot sword on replay cam as we go down here yet again. Starlight now seems to be neck and neck with Spider and Washi. It's pretty close at the moment. Whoa, I know with some speed there, but he loses it as he overspeeds that section. You wouldn't want that much speed. Starlight now taking the lead. This is this looking good. I don't want to say anything more. I'm just going to keep quiet for the final sector. Starlight's gone wide a bit. I'm not sure that's going to be enough speed. Looking good. But I don't think it's looking good enough because uh, I know's nowhere to be found. I, Spider just hit the fucking wing, didn't he? He's fucking hit the wing. He's fucking hit the wing, everyone. So uh, yeah, Spider manages to finish fifth instead. Yeah, Hot Sword's really good on the drift, so... Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, it's not looking good. Ireland are one map round win away from actually advancing to match number 5. And Singapore's exit door is kind of flashing green right now. Because, uh, yeah, it's legit open for them at this point. Uh, did someone crash again? Did two people crash at the same section or something? I am confused. The camera's not even keeping up anymore. Spider now ahead, but as it stands, did someone crash again? I think Starlight crashed. Yes, now Aina has taken over fourth. Spider is carrying Team Singapore way too hard, and he's not even gonna finish anyway because Hot Swords probably gonna win this. Why? Right? I have no idea. Wow, that was really close, but Hot Swords snipe Spider, and that means uh, Ireland have won this match, map and match three 0 They move on. To a 2-2 record and move on to match number 5. GG. Singapore are sadly knocked out. Uh, and uh, yeah, I got nothing else to say. That was uh, quite the embarrassing performance. Not gonna lie, I'm sorry. But uh, it's it was pretty close the first map. But we just lost it in the last two maps. It seems map 10 was pretty much not what we wanted. But yeah, that was it 
for the cast, I think, because uh, yeah, that ends Singapore's journey in TSCC Winter. I mean, I'm still proud because uh, again for the second year, sorry, second year, sorry, second season in a row, uh, we made it to day two, so I'm perfectly fine with that. We just want to go a little bit further than day two. Let's just put it that way. Thanks for the cats. Okay, <laughs> cats. Cast. <laughs> I mean, I do have a cat here at home, but he's he's like sleeping at the moment, so I can't you can't say thanks to the cat, unfortunately. But anyway, thanks all for dropping by. Uh, GG, so Island, and good luck on your next match. Yes, I also do love cats as well. Uh, for but yeah, thank you all for watching.